The Jandans are busy preparing for Ramadan. From the oldest to the youngest, everyone in the Turkish family is involved in decorating the house or making gifts to celebrate Islam's holiest month. I think Ramadan is great. We receive gifts from our parents and I also write cards to my friends. Fasting during the day can be tough, so a handmade calendar filled with little gifts for each day of the month is keeping everyone motivated. Although the idea may be inspired by a Christmas tradition, the family says it raises awareness of their own Islamic holidays without commercializing them. I think we shouldn't act like rivals, but profit from the cultural diversity here in Germany. As little kids, we all saw advent calendars during Christmas, but didn't have such things for our celebrations. So we adopted it, but added our own cultural and religious identity to it. Crafting and decorating together is not only a fun way to reflect and spend time together, but it also brings Islam closer to the children as they grow up in a non-Muslim country. Decorating the house for Islam's holiest month has become a growing trend in many countries that aren't predominantly Muslim. And with the needs of their Muslim communities changing, some have spotted an opportunity. Blogger Vanessa Tandreverde is designing and selling her own Ramadan products. The mother of two started her business three years ago after she went in search of creative ways to educate her children about Islam and found none. Because I converted to Islam, I'm lacking this repertoire of beautiful memories that other Muslims have, so my aim was to establish them not only for myself but for my children. I started to design cookie cutters with Islamic motifs, and now we'll also sell Ramadan calendars and posters with Arabic motifs to show the kids that these elements are part of our daily life. Vanessa's ideas have proven popular. Today she has several thousand customers worldwide, from Italy to Australia. And although similar shops have started to pop up, she doesn't consider them rivals. I think the market is big enough and does need more material on offer. So the more there is, the better. We can only encourage and help each other. And this will hopefully lead to every child being able to one day say, my Ramadan is special. And as this smile shows, Vanessa can be sure of having added to a beautiful Ramadan memory this year. Sibel Karkusch, TRT World, Essen, Germany.